We have time for a brief question. The Honourable Member for Courtney Alberney. Madam Speaker, 11 people every day die in this country from death by suicide. A third of those deaths are people amongst the ages of 45 and 59, and it's the second leading killer between people the ages of 15 to 34, and men are three times more likely to die of suicide. And our good colleague from Timmins, James Bay, put forward a National Suicide Prevention Action Plan motion that was adopted in this House unanimously back in May of 2019. And the National Collaborative for Suicide Prevention wants to see that enacted, and I'm hoping today that we can actually talk about something and work together on. And I ask my colleague through you, Madam Speaker, does she agree that the government needs to implement this right away? Because we see the grief and the trauma this gives to people that are impacted when they've lost a loved one to death by suicide. The Honourable Member of Carlton Trail, Eagle Creek, a brief answer, please. Thank you, Madam Speaker. And I want to thank that member for his very important question. I agree with him that uh, creating a national strategy to address mental health, to address um, the increase in suicides all across this country is very important. Having a member that committed suicide, having a family member that committed suicide, I absolutely agree that more needs to be done.